Hi everyone, Hunter Schrader here with Black Hills Institute. Now, we've normally been doing Fossil of the Week videos, but we have a little extra treat for you guys, because one of the best things about paleontology is you get to meet a lot of great people. So I have with me someone who I'm very excited to meet. This is Hayden Samick from uh, Backcountry Manifesto. Yep. So tell us a little about, about Backcountry Manifesto. So Backcountry Manifesto is a really cool podcast. Um, I'm just going to pitch it straight to the camera now. Uh, <laughs> we, we talk to all sorts of people living their life in pursuit of outdoor adventure, everything from skydivers to uh we want to talk to your buddy adam about caving to uh paleontologists to uh all, all sorts of really interesting people so it's for people with wicked add like me <laughs> who are interested in all sorts of cool things that you can do outside and like all sorts of cool ways that you can pursue adventure man so yeah that's what the bad country manifesto is it's a podcast you can find us on all the stuff and on youtube and everywhere that sounds really cool so you how long have you liked dinosaurs it's really funny, man. I have actually, I'm sorry, guys, I've never been into dinosaurs. Well, it, it was strange, man. I, I, I did a podcast with a dude, Jack Horner, mm. and that kind of like, I was like, oh, you know, I should probably go on a dinosaur dig to like supplement this kind of thing. So I got in touch with another dude, uh, Clayton Phipps. Oh, yes. And um, love Clayton. Really mm. nice guy. Great guy. Um, yeah. And so, you know, we started uh, talking and emailing, and then I got to go on a dig with him. And now I'm like pretty interested. I mean, it's not like, it's not my like forte. It's not like the main thing, but it's, it's an accessible, interesting thing that satisfies curiosity and like, you know, the natural wonder thing that I'm kind of after all the time. You know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. And I, I'm really glad you said that too, because so many people think like, if you didn't start watching Barney when you were yeah. five years old, <laughs> you can't get into it. But that's just not true. It's, it, it really is something for everyone. Paleontology is really really inclusive and it's great and it's just it's just a lot of fun and it's great to hear you say that so I, I think it's a really interesting way to like think about natural history in a kind of immediate way when, when we think about history a lot of times it's like you know men wearing like funny wigs and like you know pyramids and it's like i used to go see the pyramids but it's really fascinating to be out in the woods and look down or you know out in the badlands and look down and see a, a fossil and be like wow like these things that I've been hearing about my whole life really were here. And like that like little flashpoint of natural wonder, man, like that's what I'm after kind of always. So mm -hmm. I think that should appeal to everybody, right? I absolutely, it should appeal to everyone. And I, I really hope everyone does get the opportunity to do that, you know, and just, there's something about just holding it in your hands that you just can't, there's no alternative, there's we're, no solution. Like, we're seeing it in a place like this? Yeah, exactly, yeah. Which you guys can visit if you'd like. I'm gonna shamelessly plug our museum right now. We're in Hill City, <laughs> South Dakota. But, but I think that's all the time we have. So thank you so much, Hayden. It's been, a Great honor to meet you. And I, oh, dude. Yeah. Cool. Thanks, for, thanks for talking with us. We'll hang out later, man. Yeah, sounds good. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much.